welcome back to another video with me, Mystery Flipping. My name is Josh. I hope you are all well. This is episode number two of Black Friday. Um, Pre-Black Friday, sorry. Pre-Black Friday um, pop figures box. Like I said, um, in the previous one, it cost £20 a box. Um, it guaranteed uh, six pops. And every um, box would be a guaranteed value of between £30 and £90. So in the first episode, we actually hit quite lucky. Um, we got nearer to the top end of it. Um, and I spent £180 altogether. And I'm already at £153 after two boxes. We have another four, uh, eight boxes to go. Um, so we cannot complain. If you haven't seen the first episode, you will know that we're doing something a little bit different. Which is um, basically a hot sauce challenge. And I've just got to find the box out of kit somewhere. Um, because it's right here. These have numbers in. Um, currently, number two and six have disappeared. We have eight more numbers in here. Every box over there is numbered uh, one to ten. Um, and it's basically a little bit of a um, game between myself and Pop Figures. Of course, this isn't Pop Figures actually um, playing along. It's just something that I wanted to have a bit of fun with. Um, so, if Pop Figures wins, I have to do some hot sauce. If we draw... I have to do hot sauce. If I win, my mouth doesn't have to be on fire. Luckily, I am 1-0 up currently. Now, can I make it 2? I would love to make a clean sweep and win 5-0. I won't lie, because I don't want any of this. I do know that I do enjoy this hot sauce. But, I wouldn't want it on a bit of bread or individually on a bit of a, on a spoon, because I can tell you, this burns your bum. <laughs> So, this isn't a promotion, but if anyone does want to um, get yourself some, this is from Dorset. Um, so, anyone from the area, definitely, definitely, definitely go and check Dorset Chili Shop. Um, this was an amazing, amazing, amazing chili sauce. It's called Melt Your Effing Face Off. So, as you can hear, we have eight numbers left. I have my number, and my number is... We are doing... Number four for ourself. And Pop Figures box will be number 10. So I had uh, number two last, they had number six. They've now got number 10, and I have number four. So what I will go and do is go over there, grab the two boxes, and I'll be right back. And I have the two boxes just down below me. Um, as I said, we have number 10 right here. That is, of course, Pop Figures box. And Josh's box is number four. So, I will just double check that I got the right numbers there. Yes, four and ten. That's fine. Whew. Um, so, what I will do, again, is exactly the same. I'll keep my box here so you know what six pops I have. Theirs isn't open yet. Um, I've got hair in my mouth. Um... Again, I'm hoping, like I said, you can see some of the pots that we've got behind. I do expect duplicates. Don't don't write in the comments, oh, well, um, you just got a load of their um, stock that they couldn't sell. I know that's what's going to happen. I'm, I'm, I'm not that stupid. I've done it just because, one, I enjoy bigger mystery boxes. I don't like just buying one or two. Though I will be um, um, buying from smaller companies. Because there are a lot of companies that I haven't actually purchased from that I do want to try. Um, so we will be doing some smaller um, companies compared to like Pop Figures, Hulk Pops, etc. Um, so as you can see, we have our six right here. So our first pop is Piper. So we know exactly how much Piper's worth. Um, as I said, I'm um, recording this on exactly the same day um, as the rest, which is fine. But we have Piper. I am expecting, like I say, so many duplicates. Then we have Victor Crumb from Harry Potter. I can't complain with that. It's a new pop that we didn't have. Um, I do know a lot of people that like Harry Potter. This is a very, very heavy pop. Is this going to be Thanos or Aeroplane, maybe? No, it's none of them. It isn't any of them. It is. Is it Nagini? Nagini? Let me grab this one out. This has got to be one of the heaviest pops I've had so far. 
but we have the crimes of is it the crimes of Grindelwald. Um, we have Nagini. Nagini. Let me pop that there. Then I do apologise that the box is right here. It's like I say, when it's my box, I don't want you to think that I am cheating. Then we have Gert Yorks from Marvel Runaways. Um, I haven't actually watched this. Um, I I do like Marvel. I don't like Marvel. Um, but nonetheless, a nice um, looking pop. I might have to see what that's all about. Then we have. Ooh, ooh, I'll be keeping this one. We have Ezekiel Elliott from the NFL. This is awesome. This is from Dallas Cowboys. Um, I personally am a Jacksonville Jags fan. Um, we are funnily enough playing. I've been playing the Cowboys right now. We might not be playing the Cowboys, actually. I'm not too sure who we're playing. I did just see a notification saying that we were 6 0 up, which is pretty good. Um, but we have Ezekiel Elliott from the Cowboys, which is pretty awesome. Pop you right there, Ezekiel. And our last box, uh, our last pop, sorry, from this box. And we have, we have Mona from uh, P5 Persona 5. Not ever seen this or played it. Um, so, I'm not too sure, but I won't lie, I'm a bit worried, eh? Because I think I might be having some of this sauce. Because I know Pipe is half decent, but I don't feel like the Harry Potter ones are going to be. Is it your Elliot's probably 10? Possibly? Oh, what figures might have me, eh? But it's good that I didn't get um, many um, duplicates there. I only got one in Piper. Um, so I do expect, you know, come into the fourth box, etc. Uh, or this is the fourth one now, but I do expect when I get to like the seventh, eighth, that I start getting, you know, four or five duplicates. So I'm going to pop this one down because, of course, these aren't my ones. These are pop figures. And their first pop is, well, that's a bit of a bonus. It's a duplicate already. Nagini. Or Nagini. I don't know how to say it. Then, this is quite a light pop. We have... Oh, not a bad one. Eugene from Shazam. So a different one again. I do like Shazam, actually. A lot many people did for some reason. But I did enjoy it. I can't get into this one. Again, quite a light pop. And we have... It's <laughs> the wrong way around. It's um, Vanessa Kensington from Austin Powers, um, which isn't too bad. Um, Austin Powers um, is quite a popular um, film. So they're generally pretty decent. I've had the whole set before, um, but it's nothing that I actually collect. Then we have, here we go. Our first Fortnite pop, it is the Tower Recon Specialist. That might just save my backside. Because I doubt that's worth much. Or I hope not. Then we have... Oh no. We have Cam from Modern Family. And I know that's worth... I want to say £13. Oh, that, that's just counted Piper out. Uh-oh. And the last one we have... Is... Oh. It's Hulk Chrome. So we actually have another chrome. So it's not actually, I thought it was Thanos and I thought, oh, oh. now what I will go and do guys is I will go and check the prices. Um, give me, you know, 30 seconds and I will be right back in so a So we have the prices back and am I about to have to have some of this or not? Or am I going to make it two nil? Well, here we go. As I said, my box was number four. Um, and in my box, I had Nagini, and that was worth £10. Um, then I had Ezekiel Elliott from the Dallas Cowboys. That was worth £11. Then my cheapest one was number 89, Victor Crum. That was worth £7. And I thought, I'm in trouble here. Um, then Gert Yorkes, um was worth £8. 
and I was definitely a bit panicky here because I was there going compared to the other one. But in my head, I was there going, you know, these are only valued at maximum of thirty pound, so possibly. Then three eight nine Piper, as we had before, is worth twelve pound. Um, and finally Mona, um, who is a Persona five. Um, even though you can buy it cheaper um, than what the uh, TBD value is, it come out at eighteen pound. So my bots um, has come to sixty six pound, and I was thinking, well, it's kind of slap bang in the middle. I have a chance. Um, then we went on to box number ten, which was the pop figures box, um, and we had Najini again worth ten pounds. So I was there going, well, we know that they're going to be equal. Um, then Eugene was worth £7, and I, I was a bit more relieved then. Um, then Hulk, the Chrome, was worth £10. Then the cheapest in their box was the Tower Recon Specialist at £5. And I was there going, I felt a bit comfortable there. Um, and then Vanessa Kensington from Austin Powers was worth a whole £8. And finally, the last one was Cam, and I already knew what the price was for that, was because I have, of course, um, pulled it in a previous video, and it was worth £13. So that box only came to £53. So again, I won by £13. So thankfully, I am 2-0 up. Now, because I am 2-0 up, I decided to put a bit of a twist on. Now, what will happen is if I win 5-0... I will have to do five spoons of the sauce. So, in hindsight, I need to lose one. Um, because no matter what, I'm going to be in pain. Um, so, no matter what, I will be doing some sauce. Uh, so, if I win 5-0, it's 5. Um, if I win 4-1, of course, I just do the 1 for the one that I lose. Um, but, of course, I will do it at every episode that I lose. So... Now, it will go on to episode number three, um, and hopefully, um, by then, I may go 3-0 up. At least then, I won't be that bad. I'm hoping maybe a 4-0 win, and then just a lose one. Um, that would be quite nice. Um, but that is it. I hope you did enjoy that episode. If you did, leave a like. Comment down below which one was your favourite um, pop in this box. Um, and, of course, subscribe if you're new around here. I thank you all for the support. I hope, like I said um, prior to this, um, you did enjoy. And of course, until next time, guys, I shall see you all. Very soon.